I never imagined that two years later I'd still be doing them. People still need the messages. It's got a little system now at this point. Get the paint markers, make the outline. I have a few hundred sayings here that I rotate, put little stickers on them with more hearts, cut them out, and then they're ready to go. When I started, I was working as a bartender. They closed everything down right before St. Patrick's Day. The streets were, were empty. You would hear the sirens all over, and it was just a very sad time. I was trying to think of what I could do to make the neighborhood look a little better, and it just came to me like, oh, I'll put hearts up with little sayings of hope and inspiration. Holds me say there's going to be more things to look forward to and that this too shall pass. People call me the heart lady, so. <laughs> love is in our hearts. I love it. It's so nice. Really is. This is what we need. This is exactly what we need in the city and the world today. A lot of people need hope. My name is Elizabeth Savage, and this is called Hearts and Why. That one that you see on that cross street was almost meant for you that day. Well, lock your eyes on it because, you know, it will stand out. So everyone's so busy, and then it's just like, oh, don't be so hard on yourself. <laughs> I. Can't be that hard on myself. That's or, right. You know, okay. It's really inspiring. It brightens my day. Yes, it sure does. Absolutely. When they see it, they smile, they feel better, and hopefully they'll pass along that good vibe. Not just my day, but then it makes me want to brighten other days. I take photos of them, so if I'm, you know, needing a little pick-me-up or anything, I can kind of go through my phone. People come up to me in tears saying like, oh my God, I was at my worst and this helped me get through. Oh, you want to do a selfie? Yeah, perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's nice. great. I was actually inside a store and I seen her putting the heart. I'm like, oh, I see her in person. Let me run outside and say hi to her. I've been noticing these for quite some time and I started following her on Instagram. When I first started, I didn't have Instagram. I didn't really know about it. Once I did that, it just kind of blew up. It means somebody cares. I just put hearts up with different messages. <laughs> It makes you feel good inside. My goal is to brighten someone's day, even if it's just for a minute. Maybe I'll be kinder today. Maybe I'll be gentle with myself today. Maybe I'll smile, because maybe I didn't all day. I've put up over 15,000 hearts from Harlem to the South Ferry. A lot of love, less hate, more peace. Love makes the world go round. With my husband's encouragement, he got me to sign up and start art school. Try and expand my artistic talents, if there are any. People need to be a little more kinder, and that kindness does matter. So as Elizabeth said, she's put up more than 15,000 hearts all over New York City, and she has no plans of slowing down yet. So if you actually want to see those hearts in your neighborhood, you can send her a direct message on Instagram. It's at hearts in Y.